Ladies and gentlemen, it is go time. My name is Todd Grisham, and watching this live with me is Johnny Nelson. The pleasure's always mine, my friend. It's time now for our tale of the tape. Joe Lewis, he's six foot two inches tall, 181 pounds, one of the best right hands in the business. And across the ring from him, Rocky Marciano. He's five foot ten inches tall, one of the greatest heavyweights to ever live. The Brown. This bout is expectation. And here's the bell for round one. Land. They exchange punches. Good punch. Good punch. Slugger, as you know, he's willing to take three to give one. That's his game plan, and it's worked out pretty well for him so far. A win is not just a win for some fighters. They need to feel the blood, the crunch. They need to get that win. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. Got out of the way that right hook. How is he still on his feet? Couldn't wait longer to get back and get engaged. seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. It's not over till it's over, but that knockdown. What do we expect to see here in round two? Nice exchange here from both men. He misses with the left uppercut. You're not going to see a lot of finesse and skills from this guy. He wants to bury his forehead in your chest and pound away. You're going to swarm on your case. You know you've got to fight. You've got to hold him. You've got to tie him up. You're going to lean on him when he come in until the referee makes you break up. But keep your hands high because that will keep punching until that referee said stop. Showing exceptional chins, by the way. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. You can tell he's stronger, but he's not faster. Neither man really defending himself. Just misses with that big right hand. He gets out of the way of that left hand. This round's still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Inside of three minutes, we just saw I sit on to the third.
Let's see if these two heavyweights decide to exchange bombs early or decide to box a little bit. Because they're so big, because they can push, because they've got the weight behind them, they may not be connecting, but trust me, when they connect, that's when this fight sets on fire. Because someone's going to get hurt, and someone's going to hit. for a minute if they want to. Nice score with that left hand. Rocky Marciano covering up, trying to buy some time to get out of trouble. Big shots from both these fighters. Got to be careful, though. Well, he's got him right where he wants him. Can he put him away? I thought that was the end, but here we go again. Back into the fire. heard the phrase, finding a second win. I don't think I need to tell you which one of these fighters needs to find it. Now this is about desire. This is about character. This is about what? Right punch. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. Dominant round there. Let's see how they respond here in the next round. Dominance without a doubt make it look so, so easy. And here's the bell to start round four. Both men step back for just a moment. with that jab. Energy and endurance are not an issue for this fighter who continues to be aggressive as the rounds wear on. Sometimes when you have a fight, the best way to beat a fight is not give them what they want. Because they want to get there, they want you to stand there, time to come with them, and have a terror. That's what they do in the gym every single day of the week. What you've got to do is you've got to frustrate them as they set this up. Get out of the way. And they'll get so angry, so frustrated because they can't work. What a shot that put him down. One, two, three, four, five, six. Neither man really defending himself. Missed him with that uppercut. Final 10 seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. So it's plan B time. Time for the fifth round. Showing exceptional chins, by the way. You've seen all the famous boxing movies, the training scenes, the gym rush. That's what it all boils down to. Who's going to have more endurance? Well, you've got two fighters that are absolutely shattered. What gets you through? Willpower. Calm, because if you panic, you get best.
desperate. If you get desperate, you make mistakes. If you make mistakes, you get knocked out. Both men step back for just a moment. Exchanges from both men in this round. That left hand misses. We've seen in the past in this fighter, they don't get concerned when they lose some of the earlier rounds because they know they've got that power that can strike at any moment. Power. That power might be the do or die. That power might be the, the, the equalizer. Nice exchange here from both men. Very close round with 10 seconds to go. After what we saw in that last round, it's pretty obvious who has the advantage here. You can't leave it up to the judges. It's up to you as a... This is the beginning of round six. Through the hook, didn't land. Perfect punch. This fighter has determined that they can walk through any punches that their opponent throws, and that's a very confident spot. Rocky Marciano covering up. Oh, do you believe this? Rocky Marciano is down! Shots like that in the gym. At least for once, this is on TV. Thousands around the world saw that shot. They probably even heard it. <laughs> 